Hello, and welcome to another exciting webinar from Atlas Copco, the world leading provider of industrial power tools and solutions. If you have any questions during today's webinar, please leave them in the question box. You should see a response in your email within 24 hours. Now, let's get started. Welcome to the Transition to Wireless Tools webinar. In this webinar, we will be reviewing the benefits of using wireless tools in the manufacturing environment especially in modern manufacturing where many customers are already transitioning to Industry 4.0. The benefits of using wireless tools are extensive and include a more flexible production environment where wireless tools are usually free to move around the station and can be easily rebalanced if the line changes. High-speed tightenings will lower tack time and help to boost productivity. Low reaction strategies will make for a much better operator experience, with reaction forces, noise, and vibration all reduced. And improved quality with smart wireless tools that help to ensure the fastening was done correctly the first time. Here we see a pretty standard auto manufacturing plant. Our example here today is motor vehicles, but this can be applied to any assembly process, like tractors, off-road vehicles, or appliances. If we zoom in a little, we can get a better look at this station. You'll see it gets a little more crowded with some material delivery, include the end on board, and it's starting to look like a real plant. Now this station is currently not very flexible. The torque tube and articulating arm assist with reaction forces, but impede the operator's access to the vehicle. If you needed to make changes to this line, even something as simple as a planned tool change, it could end up being very costly. Let's remove those fixtures and replace them with wireless tools and a PowerFocus 6000. With multiple tools connected to a PowerFocus 6000, you can free up much needed floor space. The low reaction strategies available will continue to protect the operator from reaction forces and the removal of the fixtures will improve movement for the operator. Next, we'll take a look at two stations side by side. The one on the left is using traditional direct drive tools. One tool is suspended from a balancer for support and uses a reaction bar for ergonomics. The other tool is on a torque tube, which provides its reaction point. These tools access is restricted by the same safety features designed to protect the operator. Now the station on the right has no fixtures but they weren't removed at the detriment to the operator. They're still safe and using wireless tools with low reaction strategies. A TBP is capable of high torque fastenings with little to no reaction in a one-handed operation. And the SRB can perform mid-range torque that would have been previously performed with a right angle tool. These new tools also operate at a higher RPM than previous, thanks to the ActiDrive battery power system more power is delivered to the tool, enabling it to run at higher speeds than before. This gives you faster rundowns and quicker tack times. Another important benefit of wireless tools is improved safety and ergonomics. If we look at this station, we can see there are some obvious safety issues. Right away, I see a cable draped across the floor of the work area. Now I know that nobody watching this video would ever do that, but it does happen. You could festoon the cable overhead where it's safe and out of the way, or you can replace it with a wireless tool, eliminating the trip hazard and helping to protect the operator. Next, air impact and pulse pistols can easily be replaced by TBP. Drastically reduce vibration, noise, and operator fatigue. And finally, address dangerous pinch points by reducing reaction forces. Using wireless tools with low reaction strategies will give you access to work without compromising safety. I hope it's clear by now that wireless tools from Atlas Copco offer substantial benefits to modern assembly processes. But probably the most important feature of these tools is that they are smart tools. With accurate transducers, they are able to measure torque angle, and speed throughout the entire fastening. Bad rundowns are able to be detected and notify the operator with on-tool feedback. This type of information is critical to ensure 
that fastenings are done correctly and avoid costly rework. Thank you for watching the Transition to Wireless Tools webinar. I hope you found this information helpful. For more information, please contact your local Atlas Copco representative.